Hey guys, welcome back to Chaos Core Tech. My name is Garrett and today we're going to be making a model car. That's right, a model car. We are going to be venturing into new territory. I've never tried to do this before. I had a friend reach out to me and ask to do this as a personal project. So we originally weren't even going to post this video, but we thought that one, it would be decently interesting and two, people might like to have this model out there. But as we were creating this, I didn't do any actual filming. Luckily, I did grab all of the modeling and painting footage, so at least I have that. So we're going to do a little bit of time traveling now to about a month ago when I created this in Fusion 360. Okay, so once the modeling was done, we printed it. We mostly printed it on the Prusa Mark II S. We did some experimental runs on our CR-10 and also the Robo R2. We even tried to experiment with some clear windows using some clear PolySmooth and polishing it. Um, we didn't end up going with that because you could still kind of see the layer lines. They weren't bad, but we ended up going a different route. And I'll talk a little bit more about that at the end of this video. So now let's time travel once again and see Chelsea paint this thing.
there you have it guys. That was my version of the Volkswagen bus. If you want to see the files for this, they are down in the description linked to the Thingiverse page. Like I said before, this was created in Fusion 360 and it was actually quite a bit of fun to create because I could find a picture from the side directly on. So I, it was pretty easy just to sketch the things in place and get the basic shape of the bus. Even though I did use the sculpting tools to get the, the main shape and then I used sketches to cut out all of the details like the windows, the handles, and the little um, separations where the doors and all the seams were. And I've never really done a vehicle before, but it is definitely something that I had wanted to try because there's a lot of people in my family that are car lovers and so I thought it would be a great gift for them to make like a small model of the cars that they like. I just hadn't ventured into that territory yet. So if this is something that you guys like and want to see more of and maybe even see a tutorial on, let me know down in the comments because I would be more than willing to do that type of thing. And then I briefly wanted to talk about the windows. So we wanted the windows to be clear because obviously windows are clear. Um, and we tried the poly smooth, but like I said, there was lines. So what we ended up doing, um, this was a little bit of creativity on Chelsea's part. She works at a bakery and they have those clear little containers that they um, give out bars and cupcakes, I believe, in. So she grabbed one of those and basically just cut out the shapes so they would fit in there and then she glued them in place. So it was a super simple solution and it actually looks great. And then that's it for me guys. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up, get subscribed below, ring that bell so you can be notified when I post new videos. It really does help us a lot. Alright guys, well thank you for watching, and until next time, keep creating.